A family who lost their home and everything they owned in the Marshall Fire then had their SUV stolen with their belongings in it and they're finally getting their stuff back. Yeah, it's wonderful. Today, police found that stolen car in Jefferson County. Nicole and Ryan Fazio say the only things they grabbed when they were evacuating were a couple of bins of photos of Ryan's mother who passed away last year. It was the only thing they felt wasn't replaceable. The pictures were then in their vehicle when it was stolen. Today, police called them to give them the news they've been waiting for. It was the deputy and she had said that they had just found my car and she was standing next to it, guarding it until they could wrap it and figure out what <laughs> to do. He puts it on speaker so. and I'm just like, okay, okay, just go look in the back. I need you to just walk up to the window, look in the back. <laughs> there should be two plastic tubs. Like that's the most important part. And she looks in and she's like, yeah, there's two tubs in there. And I just started screaming. The mm. Fazio was told that police have not looked in the tubs yet. They're hoping the pictures are in there. Okay, there's a bit of damage to the vehicle. They're not sure how much. They say the car is supposed to be processed tomorrow, and then they should be able to get those photos. When we first told that story, I thought, no, e no. no. There's just there's no there's no way that that turns out well. No, you know. But man. That's that's super fortunate for a family that's been through a lot of misfortune. Yeah. On top of having the pictures in the car found today, the Fazio's also found a new place to live. Mm. So they've got quite a bit to celebrate tonight. Things are looking up. Mm -hmm. Love their little attitude. Little by little. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just like the family last night. They're, yep. they're, they're, they're there. And so happy by this, this thing, the one moment that they waited for. What matters most. Yeah, those pictures.